Hello, and welcome to the Cryptocurrency News Channel. So we have news, and it's a good news for brave uh, browser users. You can finally cash out your BAT tokens. There is a caveat to this, but you can finally ca cash out your BAT tokens. You, you don't have to just use them to tip or give. You can actually cash them out. So brave browser users, take heart. The basic attention token is starting to look like a complete ecosystem. And I actually do think this is the reason why BAT actually has surged recently. In addition to Twitter and Reddit tips and privacy protecting ads, the creators of the decentralized web browser have added a new capability, allowing Brave users to exchange their tokens for fiat. This means if you spent the last year dutifully collecting BAT allowments or watching Brave ads to earn tokens, you finally have a chance to spend them. In a blog post published today, the Brave browser revealed that with the latest desktop version, 0.69, users can choose to transfer BAT tokens out of their Brave Rewards wallet, so you can actually transfer them out of your Brave Rewards wallet and convert the tokens to many digital assets and fiat currencies. Previously, most users could only use their tokens for tipping and rewards, not withdrawals. Now you can withdraw them. However, there are a few caveats. Since withdrawals are managed through Brave's integration with Uphold, you still have to do KYC. So no escaping, no escaping taxes, people. You must do KYC to withdraw, as well as pay the spread for an uphold conversion. It also means that if you're in, you're in a jurisdiction where uphold doesn't operate, like New York, your tokens might be stuck in your wallet for now. So those of you who are in New York, you're still screwed. But for the rest of us that don't live in New York, we're not screwed anymore. So you can actually cash out your BAT tokens. And I think this is just a big step for BAT's ecosystem growth. This will probably get more people to use their browser. And more people using their browser hopefully means more people turning on the subscription option. And a significant number of people turning on the subscription option means that we might actually get an internet with less intrusive ads or no intrusive ads in the future as people more turn more to Brave, stuff like Brave and Coil, whichever one wins out in the future for advertising revenue. So hopefully sooner or later we can say goodbye to pop-ups and stuff like that and just kind of depend on a more subscription-based revenue based on voluntary subscriptions from Brave or Coil. Now I'm still very skeptical of these things, but that it'll actually work and you'll get enough people that are willing to actually, um, get enough people that are actually willing to um, voluntarily donate part of their back tokens. But if that's possible, then it is indeed a, like a revolutionary change for internet advertising revenue. And that sucks for all the ad companies, but it's actually great for uh, content creators like myself, um, whether on YouTube or my website, because it lets me design a website without ads. It lets my website load a lot faster and it uh, makes me less dependent on what the ad companies want. And also like all the cookies and tracking kind of go away as well. So that is the news for today. So rejoice, brave uh, browser users. You can withdraw now. That is the news for today. Like and subscribe and hit that bell notifications button. And also uh, join me on my daily streams every weekday. Thank you and have a nice day.